So here's how to add an end screen on YouTube. It is very easy to do. So if you go to upload a video, here's the steps that you're going to walk through. What you can do is simply click on the video elements or you can click through next a couple of times. That's what I'm going to do. So let's click on next. Next is going to be the monetization aspect. I'm just going to click off so I can get through quicker. Let's click next. And of course, this is where the end screen aspect is going to be. I usually don't use the import from video. I just click on add right here and it makes your life so much easier. There's a few things that you can utilize here. There's also going to be the element section like videos, playlists, subscribe, channel, and link. For example, with a channel, if you wanted to add any channel, you can do that specifically. But I think some of these are going to be the best. Personally, I love the one video and one subscribe section. You can do one with two videos. You can do one with one playlist, one subscribe, one video, one playlist, or you can do one video, one playlist, and subscribe. Nevertheless, I like this one. And once we do that, I do like clicking on show hover card. That means when they hover over, it's going to show that. And for this, for the best for viewer, that's going to be pretty good as well. We can actually click on this too. So we can do most recent upload or we can choose specific videos. So if you do do that, you can scroll through and just simply click on a video that you might want to utilize. But I think YouTube knows the viewer best. So I like doing best for viewer personally. I don't think I can make it any longer because the video is shorter, but... I can say go like here. Let's say it started at 45. Same thing with this. So both of them show up at the same time. So once you get a little bit further in, you're going to see that's where they show up. And of course, once you're done with that, simply click on the save button. And from there, obviously, you would go to next, publish your video, and that's how you can very quickly and easily add an end screen. You know, you can add a little bit more to it. Some people will methodically say have a blank, say like last 10 seconds or so, and that's where they will add it in, where they maybe have a picture of themselves, like pointing to where the video would be or pointing to where the subscribe button would be. But that's going to be up to you if you want to add a little bit more. I personally just like adding an end screen based upon what's going to be shown in the video. It works for me and it's very easy to do. So if you have any other questions, feel free to leave a comment down below, but that should be the very quick tutorial for you about how to add an end screen on your YouTube videos. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.